it's been, what, three months since I last saw you? But today I am going to be making up for that lost time and explaining it all to you. Everything that's been going on in my life, keeping you up to date, and also I'm here for a very special reason, um, and that is you have given me a hundred subscribers. Thank you so much if you are one of those people. That is freaking amazing. Thank you so much. I thought it would be a pretty funny idea if I marked the occasion is to pick a hundred stinging nettle leaves and eat them for you today. And each and every single one of these leaves represent one of you guys. So thank you. So I'll just show you the proof. Now, you have to just believe me because I'm not going to count them all out, but I literally did pick a hundred, so. So I'm just going to do my usual technique and pile them on top of each other. What has happened since I last saw you guys? Let me have a think. Well, the big sad news is I am no longer with my partner. I am a single mum and it's going okay, I guess. At the moment I'm living with my parents in a beautiful location. I can't complain, but it is in the middle of nowhere. It's very isolating. Yeah, I'm moving into a little town. It's just gonna be us two, so it's gonna be weird, a bit full on, but I'm sure we can get through it. Damn, these are dry as hell. <laughs> the best time to eat stinging nettles is in the spring, and they're good in soup, but not so good like this. What else to change? So obviously, I mentioned the house. So that's, um, yeah, that's what's been taking up all my time. You saw the videos that I've posted previous to this of me doing it up. I haven't posted the final video yet because it is taking forever to do bits and bobs. And because of lockdown, everybody's wanting to do home improvement. So I've been in limbo for about three months. I won't know myself when I moved in, it's gonna be amazing. I'm still gonna do that final video of showing you around, showing you what we've been up to the final reveal before me and Arlo trash it again. <laughs> this is taking so much longer than I thought it would. <laughs> Look, this is how much I got through. <laughs> Whose idea was this? Late next time I could just make a soup and just eat that in front of you. That'd be better, right? I don't know, they were, there was actually word of them doing the Stinging Out Leading Championship this year because it's been on hold for ages because the pub that it was originally held at um, the owners just like ran it into the ground basically but um, if they do I'll, I'll bring you along with me and I'll show you how it, how it all goes down you just have to have a, a good about of beer on you if you're eating and watching <laughs> one year they had um, the Wurzels playing actually They've had quite a few celebrities eating there too. Um, Rory McGrath, um, Chris Packham, who's that other guy? Ben Fogel, to, to name a few. Oh, and my claim to fame. Yeah, and got invited to go on uh, Russell Howard's Good News. <laughs> and um, I, I really should have taken them up on the offer because it's just once in a lifetime kind of thing, but confidence is pretty zero and even doing this, I'm still not 100% especially being outdoors because I have a feeling that people might be able to hear me god this is um I forget how much hard work this is okay I'll show you how we're getting on now maybe quarter of the way there half of, half of the way there yeah it's not too bad but yeah my dad was invited to like loads of stuff um, and he did it as well he was on tv a couple of times he did radio interviews mainly though but if you want to check him out on YouTube, just type in Simon Slay, Slay as in S-L-E-I-G-H, and you'll find some of his interviews on the BBC and stuff on YouTube. I mean, in other news, I've lost about a stone, so that's kind of cool. Um, just eating stinky nails now. <laughs> that would be an awful diet. I've tried a couple of times to do a Q&A, and, &A, and um, I've, no one's ever responded, and I've had one... <laughs> One person responded, that happened to be my ex's mother, whilst I was with him at the time. Her question was, have you ever made sourdough bread? And now I can answer you, no. Okay, that stung my tongue that time, wasn't being careful enough. Oh, I'm gonna feel this tomorrow. Okay, I'm gonna do one more mouthful. Oh my god. Well, 
I've had my dose of iron for a long time. So I ate like 80, not quite 100, sorry. Fail. So, hope you're all doing well. Thanks for watching. I hope it was vaguely interesting and now you know exactly what I'm doing with my life and what's the next chapter gonna hold? I don't know, I'm not sure, who knows? But it's a clean slate, fresh start and all that. Um, and it's, it's exciting. Don't know what's around the corner, but I'll take you with me and you can explore with me. Please like and subscribe to this channel. Um, just to say that, you know, I haven't gone through all of this for nothing. That'd be great. <laughs> Follow me on Instagram and TikTok if you like. And I will see you sooner rather than later.